Hello everyone and welcome to my first race in Project Cars 2. Today we are in the Lotus 49 with the Cosworth tuned engine and we're going to be doing a 5 lap race around the classic Spa circuit. We're going to be starting from the back and seeing basically if we can make our way through the field. Uh, AI difficulty is on 85 I believe. I've not quite got it up to maximum difficulty yet as I am still learning it a little bit. But yeah, I'm just... This is going to be like a, a demonstration video basically just showing how I'm getting used to the game, what my thoughts are on it and uh, yeah, just a first race to give you guys some content. It does take a little while to load is something I would say. Which can be a little pain sometimes but yeah. I suppose it's worth the wait though when you get into it because the graphics and the sounds actually are very good. The handling is pretty good as well. I am on a controller though, let's not forget. Uh, they should all th they should all be in the same class as me. I'm not going to mess with setup just yet because I don't think we will need to. That sounds very good. Oh, that's the wrong view. There we go. Bogging down a little bit off the line. Whoa, very floaty at the front end. I just go quite slow through the first turn. Everyone bunching up. Picking up a couple of positions off. Try and feed it through here. Managed to do it. I like this car, it feels very nice to drive. You might notice a few of the cars in front have a big rear spoiler. I don't have a big rear spoiler. Look at that, straight around the outside there. Ooh, very close to actually losing it there, I tried to be completely flat. This corner I've noticed that AI seems to be a little bit quicker than me. Ooh, nudging the wall slightly there, I'm amazed we didn't get damaged. Down into fourth gear through this fast right hander. Little lift, little dab on the brake, goes left and then very quickly back to the right, gotta get the line correct. Another slight nudge on the wall there. The blue car behind me looks a little bit like a Brabham. He's got some more straight line speed than we have though. Took it in the slipstream, why not? 173 miles an hour. I think it's a little lift through here. Dab on the brakes there, we kept it going though, we managed to get some really good momentum out of there. Took in the slipstream, go to the left. 185, 190 on the red limiter. He's coming back up the inside. Ooh, he should be more careful on the brakes there. Whoa, very twitchy there, almost dropped it. You've got to basically constantly stay in the slipstream. Obviously it is just mostly flat out, but it is a good track. Very nearly running in the back of him. Oh, and again. Oh my God. That was quite sketchy having to break there. <laughs> Had to really slam on there so I didn't crash and nearly lost it on the grass. So I'm liking the game. These people behind me got a decent slipstream on me. The guys in front slightly broke away there because they had to slam on.
very slow through there to go in. I did nudge the guy in front of me. I don't think I've got any damage because my engineer hasn't told me. You, 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 usually if you do pick up any damage, your engineer tells you straight away. You can see the AI really struggling there. Send it down the inside of a few of them. Up into P8 now. Started from P20, remember? So we're going to have 12 positions on the first lap. Ooh, a lot of understeer. Hard oh, on the throttle. Whoa, going through the little plastic bollards there. Thank God they're only plastic. Lift the rear, the AI there going very brave. It's still there. Oh, I'm not paying attention. I don't know how I've not got damage. I'm a bit glued to the wall there. I don't think I've actually got damage, which is amazing. I hit that at quite, quite a high speed. Thought I would have got damage from that. Obviously no flashbacks in this game as well, which is something to, you really have to be careful, like F1 if you make a mistake you can just undo it, whoa he nudged me there, on the grass, not good, messing that up, this just goes to show though that I am not completely used to the game just yet, I've only had it a few days. Very good game though, I am enjoying it folks. I'm not expecting to win this race as it is my first time out. Uh, I just want to put on a good show for you guys, let you know how I'm progressing through the game. He's got a mighty straight line speed there. He's got the big rear wing, he looks quite squirrely. Carry more speed through the corner, down into forward, hard on the throttle once again. In slipstream, can we do anything? He's got the slipstream of the car in front, starting to pull back ahead of me now. Whoa! Really having to slam on the... I've turned the AI aggression up to about 75 as well, by the way, folks. Got a decent run there. 8th place, getting on 7th and 6th, he ooh. It looks like he might have damage in this blue car, he's going quite slow. Look at that, straight on the outside. On the grass there, have we made the overtake? Just about. Quite floaty to be fair, this car. Three needs fit, he's coming back at me. Look at that, there he goes. Seems he's got a bit more straight line speed than us. Try and get him on the brakes. Not quite. Oh, I've spun him. My apologies there, bro. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> that was uh, an accident. Whoa, there's an accident in front. We're up to second place now. Leave it in second gear through there. Six and a half seconds behind the leader. I'm not sure if we're going to catch him. We're going to try, of course. That is something I've noticed in the game, is that AI can sometimes make quite big mistakes. I need to turn that potential lap thing off, it's very annoying. Get off the grass, man.
I love this guy though, for hopefully in some clean air, he might be able to catch the guy in front. Six and a half seconds still the gap. I will quickly pause it because I've got a very itchy nose and I'll grab a quick sip of coffee. Keep me alive. Whoa. Continue on. Try and keep on the power. That's my best first sector so far. Red matching into fourth there. Bit of heel and toe on the controller. There you go, back on the power once again. Try and keep it as smooth as possible. Classic F1 car, it's a little bit floating, a little bit understeery at times, but it is manageable. I've got a lot of fuel on board, I've just realised, probably doesn't help. The gap is going up, it's now up to 8 seconds in this straight line, so he's definitely quicker in a straight line, this, this guy. But my best hope is probably the second, uh, probably the first and third sector. Probably didn't need to downshift there, but always helps to turn the car in a little bit. Through the corners, I am catching the guy in front. Hard on the power, hard on the power, keep it planted. Whoa, that was close, but I kept it planted. Gap now 6.6, .6, so we gained nearly a second pretty much of that one corner. And this bit is just completely flat out. Down into four through that bit. Back up into fifth. And then down fourth again. Probably. Whoa, touch the inside curb there. Almost dropped it, but we are gaining on the guy in front 5.3 seconds now. So you see in the corners we are catching. Seems to be a bit quicker down the straight, so. And here you want to go early on the brakes, good downshift into forward. Turn it in nice and early. And here, just lift, slide down on the brakes. Ooh! That might have been a bit too much. I'm amazed I didn't get damaged once again, though. I don't like driving in that view. Now into first that time, just to get the car stopped and turned in. Down to four and a half seconds there. But as we cross the line, it's back up to five seconds. Whoa, been on the grass there. That was sketchy. Just lighting up the rear tires there, going up or rouge. Or Radeon. Seems like we're struggling now actually in straight line compared to at the start of the race. Obviously the Cosworth engine likes to be revved. We're on lap 4 or 5 here. I don't know if we're going to catch the guy in front. We've made quite a sizeable gap to the car behind us, but... Turn in nice and early. Lift. Hard. Back on the throttle. Back on the throttle. Whoa, that was... That was 140 miles an hour in, onto the grass there. That was very frightening. I would rather not do that again.
This car though is a real treat to drive. Do we derby flat? No we don't. Again, quite a lot of time through there though. We were going we were absolutely flying through there again. Pretty much a second on the guy in front. But the gap's still six and a half just because the straight lines he seems to have a bit of uh, bit of an advantage over us. That was close, using a little bit of the runoff. Oh, slow down to avoid being given a penalty. Keep it planted. Really need to push hard here if I'm going to try and catch him. That bit definitely down into fourth though, he cannot stay in fifth. If you turn in early enough here you can stay in fifth, like that. Gap now four and a half seconds. It's going back up though, up to four up to five seconds now already. So he definitely has a straight line speed advantage over us. Much better through there, down to four seconds once again. I can actually see him now for the first time in this race. That was very brave through there. Hard on the brake, hard on the brake, harder, 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 harder. I can see him, three seconds is the gap now. Floaty up there, this car. We can see him now, though. Here's the target. Bit of grass. Down to third. Early on the power, as early as we can be. 2.5 seconds the gap now. We just need to be very committed on this lap and we might stand a chance. There he is, folks. Come on, car, come on. And foot hard down here, folks. Caught a little bit of curve there, really unsettled the car. was risky just trying to get as much time as I can through the bends as I know that's the only place we're really making ground come on car let's do it through here again let's try and keep it above 160 through this section not quite Still getting on the guy in front through that section though. We've got to be extremely committed up here. This last section, this is all we've got to win this race. We don't get a penalty. I don't know what we would get a penalty for. Oh, we did get a penalty. Un unsportsmanlike conduct. Okay, two second time penalty. Well, we're not going to win. 
can we get first on track? If we manage to get first on track, I'll take it as a victory because I don't understand where we got the penalty. I mean, as far as I'm concerned, I didn't do anything wrong. We're not quite going to do it. Scrape the wall there on the way out. Unless we be extremely brave here and then very late on the brakes, I don't think we're going to do it. Come on, come on, go, 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 go! Go, car, go! Ah, oh, damn! I mean, we were so close there at the end. Damn, if it wasn't for that penalty, I think we, we, uh, yeah, I think we did really, uh, really well there. If you guys enjoyed that as much as I did, please press the like button. Uh, be sure to comment on the video as well. I know we didn't win. We came very close and I think if we didn't get that penalty for some strange reason, I don't know why it gave us a penalty, but yeah, if you guys did enjoy that, please feel free to press the like, comment, subscribe button, all that good stuff, and I will see you in the next video, folks. Thank you very much for watching. Take care.